Hello and welcome to the fourth video on tense and aspect in English. In this video, we continue with the perfect. So, before we mentioned adverbials that are um, very often found in the present perfect and are excellent cues for the use of the present perfect. Now we move on to the verbs that actually occur in the present perfect quite a lot. I have not changed anything for about four years. Do you feel this particular incident has changed your attitude towards life? Scientific debate about this has developed into a veritable battle of faith. Other parts have evolved to meet social changes. Many adults developed an immunity to tuberculosis in this manner. Do you think the place has changed much since the takeover? The other view is that institutions have just evolved. So you may have noticed that these verbs have some sort of like similar meaning in common. For example, I could say, do you feel this particular incident has changed your attitude toward life? In the, in the sentence, changed is a bit similar to developed or evolved. Um, if we look at um, the third sentence, scientific debate about this has developed into a veritable battle of faith. We could easily use the verb change here as well. Scientific debate about this has changed into a, variable, a veritable battle of faith. We could even use evolved here. It has evolved into a veritable battle of faith. Other parts have evolved to meet social changes. Other parts have developed to meet social changes. So this does not always work, but you can see that we can actually sometimes swap these verbs and they still make sense. This should give us a, a bit of an impression of what the perfect is used for. 